Patreon poll topic, Ian. Patreon.com slash CU podcast. You know I bully you into saying this all the time. Mm Mm-hmm. And then you can get time. Ian gets his, his writings, uh, half his writings about, are about some sort of food that he's either consumed or, or created or talked to, talks about. Uh, <laughs> what he talked about Yahtzee app about a month ago. Yep. Uh, on there he talks about. And then uh, we have our Patreon poll topic. And Ian's hanger. How your how did your hangout go on Sunday? Went well. Went well. You, yes. You can you can see how Ian looks uh, before noon. Uh, besides, well, right now. I was anyway, gonna say you always see how I look before well, noon. Um, in third place, Ian's. This is not going well for your topic. 14%. Remove the film off game consoles or let it be? Only 14%. <laughs> That's gone. We tried it. Uh, ne- wow. The neck and neck at 42 and 44%. At 42%, why is the term doesn't wait age well problematic with video games? I really wanted that one to win. I can go off on that. Uh, what? And then at first place, 44%. What unlicensed NES games would have been good if Nintendo had made them? Dudes with Attitude slash Trolls with Treasure Island. I swear there's a good game in there somewhere. It's a puzzle it, game. Yep. It needs to not look like shit. It, it, needs, it needs some charm so, around so, it. I think Dudes with Attitudes, what did I give that review? I think, did I review that one? I'll go to a certain app. Um, so it's a puzzle game where the pieces move back and forth from the outer edge to the, the middle, and then you change the color of the guy to, to remove those colored blocks by hitting these little little uh, symbol, color symbols. So like yes. you hit them, you turn them, uh, green, then you bounce to the green guys and yes. eliminate them. Then you hit the red one, you bounce to the red bricks and eliminate them. It's it's puzzle slash really action. It's yeah, like, it's, it's it's there's a lot of timing to it more than anything is uh you know flipping your colors when you're supposed to. Um, oh, I got to read down. I got the, I have the beta version on my phone for the upcoming re-release. But I like I that. Download it. And yeah. then as far as that, any another one, um, I would go with Mermaids of Atlantis. Mermaids so the, of Atlantis actually has a fairly decent. It's a, it's a idea behind bubbles. it. It's another puzzle game. It's a it's a it's a it's pit puzzle three. game. I don't know. Uh, but the bubbles rise and you rotate them and you have to connect the bubbles and it, it's it's a perfectly serviceable puzzle game. I actually like it. Um, once again, though, it's just really rough around the edges because of the third party nature of it. And actually, or, uh, unlicensed. That was actually rebranded from Bald Bath Babes. It came out first. Yep. You rebrand a, 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 an adult game. That's interesting. I don't have the app open on me. I gotta read down all the app. Ian, how if Nintendo would have done Wally Bear in the No Game? You think they would have pulled it off with like using like Toadstool or using uh, Yoshi for which one? Wally Bear in the No Game. Oh, <laughs> how would Nintendo have had their anti-drug game come come to fruition in, in your mind? There, I don't know. That's a good question. Would you work in some Doctor Mario puzzle like eliminate the the yeah. dr- drugs or pop your own pills? Well, I mean, Toby. So you could have a, a, a Koopa in there to replace Toby Turtle. Okay. Uh, and, this is a turtle. Yep, and you could have. Um, so what is there? The fox. There's the fox. Have Nabbit there's the bear. In there to be the rabbit. Okay. Uh, and Nabbit could be charged with stealing pharmaceuticals from Doctor Mario. Ah, uh, okay. And I'm gonna say Toad has to go and get him back. I'm re-downloading my app right now so I can look up all the unlicensed games. What about any of the uh, the, the tension games? Oh, whoa, RBI Baseball. If that was an NES release, they would have. They would have put on some nes characters on there, but there, characters. there that would have been great there, there was a first party rbi release yeah, uh, there was went... a there was a licensed rbi release okay but then it went third okay I'll just fine don't go with my premise that could have could have talked <laughs> about for two minutes ian just blow it up okay um I'm gonna, I'm gonna look up here everything once my app gets going here unlicensed games game search you gotta be able to think one from the top of your head well, most well, ninety percent, eighty percent is 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 license on the NES. Eighty five percent is is about license. So, Tension, Color Dreams games, bunch games, Wisdom Tree games, um, ABE games, American Game Cartridge Inc. games. Those are the unlicensed companies. Am I missing one there? Um, let me let me just search unlicensed here, Ian. God, right. Jesus, just get sna- snappy with me here. <laughs> no, I'm, just, I'm surprised that the Nintendo guy does can't think. I'm of tired, that. Ian. Uh-huh. I was up till 1:30 mm-hmm. last night. <laughs> You're like, mm-hmm. uh, I'm gonna do the list view. Okay, all right. There's 95 unlicensed games. Um, so it was actually uh, we had a te- we had a Tetris one, so that that did pretty well. Um, I'm trying to see one that would have been not like a Rolling Thunder because that's. S- Semi license. <laughs> that was a real. Yeah, I don't feel like the game. Tengen carts really count. They don't count. They don't count there. 
Would Nintendo have done their own Operation Secret Storm? They would have done their own uh, uh, Desert Storm release? I doubt that would have happened there. Um, how about 2020? How about an, how about a Nintendo uh, uh, Micro Machines? That would have done that would have done gangbusters. I mean, that one actually sold very well because it was on you know Shop at Home. I think it was on QVC Micro Machines. So that actually did well. Yeah, I mean that uh, was the that was the one release that actually that they did that. Uh, you know, they, they, they kept they kept doing. I mean Chima the Micro Machines. Uh, they stopped trying to do Linus Spacehead after the uh, Genesis, but you know Micro Oof. Machines is still being made today. Oh, they're still doing that. Um, uh, let's see. I'm trying to find one that would be would fit some sort of like um, mascot or something that Nintendo could do a twist on. Because a lot of it are like double strike. It's just like a generic shooter. That's not going to work. How about Big Nose the Caveman? Big Nose the Caveman? Yeah. <laughs> so, that's like Joe and Mackish <laughs> already. What about Super Robin Hood? Super, oh, from from the Quattro <laughs> games? Oh, Jesus, yeah. God. How about Captain Comic? Honestly, Captain Comic always... Because the DOS version is kind of fun. I used to play the DOS version. That's actually a game that I think has a pretty good game hiding underneath it. Somewhere. Hiding underneath it. So, uh, what, 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 I got two and a half stars. I think that's probably a, a good call, actually, Captain Comic. Okay. Bla they wouldn't do Blackjack. They wouldn't do Bible Adventures. Baby Boomer. The, the, the NES version of Baby Boomer. That's what we want. Gumshoe. <laughs> well, <laughs> come on, Ian. You have, you have like, uh, you're shooting like uh, uh, things that are going to hit Baby Yoshi or Baby Toadstool in front of them. That could have been that something. that could have been something. Yeah. Uh, let's see. No Action 52. It's, it's, it's slim pickings when it comes to the unlicensed stuff that you think Nintendo could turn around. Pest Terminator, the Western Exterminator. You know what's funny about this? Uh, whenever I, I would visit um, my ex at her, at her condo, there was always the... the uh, Pest Terminator guy, like, because it's a real exterminator company. There was a van sitting outside. So I think I'm going to work for that company <laughs> there. Which escapes me at the top of my head which one it is, um, what company it is. But he, he has the same, you know, with, with the top hat, he's, he's hiding the mouth behind his back to crush rodents, I guess, because that's that's cute. All right. We're running, we're running out of steam here. Uh, I think he did fine with Captain Comic. With Captain Comic? Yeah. That's, that's the one. I think that was a good one. Is that going to be a Nintendo first party Sunday fun day, the ride? You're not going to get Tiles of Fate, most likely. Because uh, that's kind of like, what is that? Was that like a it's Mahjong? Shanghai. Oh, it's Shanghai. I don't there's, there's that Mahjong. Don't tell me. Don't care. Shanghai uh, don't is care. the uh, solitaire. Okay. I mean, being happy with less info is what, not good. What would be the Raid 2020 NES version? That's an anti-drug one, though, kind of. That, that wouldn't happen as well. All right. Well, thanks for the, thanks for the Patreon uh Poll topic there. We got Pole some. Topic. We got some miles there, and I have a feeling next time it might be the problematic. Uh, uh, doesn't age well. 